Hey guys, Tech Age, we're back with more vintage headphones. Today we have the Realistic Pro 50. Now, the Realistic Pro 50 is well in AKG. I mean, this is made by AKG OEM and it shares a lot of parts from AKG headphones. The, the headband is K340, sliding is K340, everything else is the sextet, and the design is specifically made by AKG for Realistic. I don't think Realistic has designed this headphone because. You know, I don't think AKG would let them do that. So they, you know, AKG has designed this headphone, just having realistic badges on it, and uh, it's using the six passive uh, six passive radiators, which the six sets are known for. Now, if you, if you guys don't know, I, I want to give you guys a brief, you know, introduction to sextet drivers. Now, sextet basically was one of the earliest implementations of a unique baffle plate. Uh, all headphones or all transducer systems, you know, baffle plate is a, is, a, is a fundamental and a very important part of the acoustic impedance and the load that comes on the on, on the driver. So a baffle is a is very important component. And AKG decided to put uh, the diaphragms basically as the passive radiators instead of you know the acoustics, you know, the silk material that they use or any other acoustic you know fabric that they usually cover on the baffle plate you know to optimize the load and the acoustic impedance of the system so you know AKG used these passive radiators now they have a certain characteristic to them uh, which you know you have to hear to believe it because in my opinion the sextet is having one of the most visceral bass responses of any electrodynamic headphone I have heard after correction because the system is highly under control it seems you know always properly damped and you know it, it just sounds sounds good it sounds pretty refined it sounds pretty good and I think these radiators are helping when it comes to, you know, proper fidelity. So now personally, the only headphone I think I can compare this sextet against is the uh, the K240M, the monitor, which sounds, again, very similar, but lacks the visceral bass response this, you know, this design has, you know, this, the Realistic Pro 50 has. And, uh, you know, it really is something you have to hear it to believe it. So, you know, I, I think they're they're quite amazing. Now, the, the aftermarket mods I've done is put a, you know, removable system, a young proof system. Put the brainwaves uh, below your pads and uh, with the k340 headband the comfort is actually quite fantastic now they do stick out a lot with these pads but you know they do sound pretty good as well uh the drivers again are akg drivers same as the k240m just with the you know the passive radiators inside and uh and everything else is, is typical akg from the time so the build quality at the end of the day is, is entirely plastic so you know don't expect astronomical you know build quality because it, it feels just like an akg so now the realistic pro 50s are pretty rare headphones they are more rare than the sextets uh, the akg sextets out there uh from what i know uh, akg when they launched the sextet they, they they were very successful but then they said you know what the sextets are too expensive to manufacture so they went to the k241 that i reviewed for you guys a couple months ago i think a couple years ago now and after the k241 people said they want the sextet back so akg briefly launched the sextet just by i think it was k240 l or m or something I, I, not not the m it was k240 s I'm, I, I'm again i'm not sure but akg briefly launched a headphone just for austrian market which was uh you know the the akg sextet basically and the, and they made a couple of a couple of iterations which you know the realistic pro 50 is one couple of philips headphone uh you know oem headphones have the same sextet design so akg made a lot of sextet you know they manufacture a lot of these headphones and they're not rare but the realistic pro 50 is one of those which you know one of those oems which you know did not manufacture a lot of the, a lot of these headphones so the realistic pro 50 when it comes to akg sextet that i i personally think is sought after but you know if you just want the sound quality go just go with a normal sextet because those are easy to find and they should sound exactly the same so i love this headphone i think it looks amazing i think it, it sounds amazing and uh, it really is a special headphone the realistic pro 50 i'll see you guys next time with more vintage headphones take it easy and like always have a good one all right Thank you.